That's good, it's good evening to all. This evening, I will do a walk on a video of St. John Parish Church in Barbados. Starting from the corner here. This road will take you back to St. John Primary School. I mean, back to Gall Hill, and back to Four Roads. And this is the St. John Cemetery here. And you can see the St. John Primary School here. So this is your pathway to St. John Parish Church. Here, once again. So walking towards St. John Parish Church once again this evening. And this is the pathway to St. John Rectory or to the church. Looking back towards St. John Cemetery. So they don't bury people in St. John Parish Church yard anymore. They bury people at the cemetery now. This is just across where you showed you just now. So this is the pathway to St. John Parish Church. We're looking back at St. John Cemetery. So this road here will be the back of the Clifton Hall, back of Martins Bay and Church View, all in the parish of St. John as well. Yep. And this is St. John Parish Church here. And this is a brief history of the church. So St. John Parish Church offers magnificent views of the east coast of Barbados. Let's go to St. John Parish Church here, which is about 1645, but this present church was built in 1836. And as I said before, this church gives awesome captivating views of the East Coast. So let's go to St. John Parish Church here. And right now, we are overlooking the east coast of Barbados from here, looking down the church view. And we can see the east coast of Barbados, looking in a northeasterly direction towards St. Joseph, 
with Bathsheba and we can see all up to the East Coast Road with Barclays Park Beach in St. Andrew and we can see all this talking about in St. Andrew which is a part of the Scotland district of Barbados so St. John Parish Church sits on a cliff on top of a cliff so this is St. John Parish Church here and as I said before it sits on a cliff St. John Parish Church, first erected in 1645, destroyed by fire and rebuilt in 1676, destroyed by hurricane and rededicated in 1836. So yes, guys, this is St. John Parish Church Rectory, where the priests used to live. I'm not sure if this current priest lives here, but Canon Mears used to live here when he was the priest at St. John. Let's go to St. John Parish Church. It's an Anglican Episcopal Church. Yes, guys. I'm in the churchyard now, where the graves are. As I said before, I don't bury people in this cemetery anymore. They bury people on the opposite side of the road now, in the cemetery, which is just further across from the church. And again, this is Pot House Village in St. John. Pot House is just below here, where the Pot House Spring is. That will be the Battle Bath Beach. I'm I'm looking in the southeastern direction. This is the southern direction now. This is Pot House Village, just below here. Pot House is in St. John. And you can see all down to Bath Beach, which is also in St. John. And you can see the old cable and wireless Earth satellite station, which is heading down to Bath Beach and the ruins for the old bath plantation and you can see all the forty school in St. Philip and all up to um, the East Point Lake House which is in St. Philip and all down to uh, Concept Bay which is another fishing village in St. John as well This is the grave of our Prime Minister David Thompson who served briefly as Prime Minister of Barbados and he died on my birthday, the 23rd of October, 2010. He was born on the 25th of December, 1961, and died October 23rd, 2010. He was the Prime Minister of Barbados briefly from 2008 to 2010. This is David Thompson here. Our He was about the fifth Prime Minister that served Barbados, David Thompson. So in this church, you will come across the graves of many famous Barbadians who died thousands of years ago. This is the binoculars here or the telescope, but you can look down on for distant viewing. You just have to insert a coin to look down. Yes, guys, the, love, the lovely view of St. John from St. John Parish Church. 
this is Pot House Village just below here. And you can see the David Thompson Power Clinic in St. John. And this is the sundial here. This is the Taylor tomb here. And this is the Carter tomb here. So St. John's Parish Church is also a part of Hackathon's Cliff as well. And this is the grave of Ferdinando Paleologos. He was buried upright. This is his tomb here. Ferdinando Paleologos, who descended from the emperor line of the last Christian emperors of Greece. Church warden of this parish from 1655 to 1656. Vestryman, 12, 20 years. Died October 3rd, 1678. And this is in the northeasterly direction now. You can see Martins Bay in St. John, which is just below here. Another fishing village and in the northeasterly direction. So this is St. John Parish Church here. Anglican Episcopal here in Barbados. All the east coast here. We're going back in the south and north easterly direction towards St. Andrew and St. Joseph, which is in the Scotland district of Barbados. All on Bashi, but you can see from here. So, thank you guys for watching now. So have a blessed evening.